This is how to make a simulator game in under 5 minutes on Roblox Studio. First you need to make sure you have this plugin installed. So it's called Simulator Generator and I'll put the link for it in the description. And once you've got it installed, make sure you click Generate. And here you can customize it whatever you want. So if in this tutorial I'm going to make it a clicker. You can change the monetization. I'll just do 50. Then select the amount of areas. Maximum is 7, minimum is 1. So I'll also do 5. And you can click Continue. Then click Generate. So here, as you can see, all the levels have been generated and all of the GUI buttons are on the screen. All of the levels are preset, so they won't be different each time you generate them, but they do work. So right now, when you click play, everything should work like this. The leaderboards were there, and then so every time you click on this button, or click on it and click on the screen and you'll start gaining money and you can buy the different so you need to go to create.roblox.com and click on your game and go to settings and also you need to make sure that it's enable studio access to api services this needs to be turned on so this is how it'll probably look for you but then you just need to click this and click save changes and you can also make it public if you want. And to make sure you get the Robux when someone buys your product, then you need to go to here, the Game Passes folder in Replicated Storage. Then where it says Value, so right here, inside this folder. In all of these, they have different values and you need to get your own. So I'll show you how to do that. Go back onto your game. Then in here, passes, click create a pass. Or you can do a developer product. So here, just type this in. You can name it whatever you want, but probably just copy me if you want it to be easier. And once you've made it, you can click on it here and go to sales and make sure item for sale is turned on and give it a price. So once you've got your price, you can click Save Changes so right here. Then to get the right code, after where it says Passes, copy that and then paste it here where it says Value. Now it should be working. And you can go ahead and do it for the rest of the things. So just click Create Pass, name it whatever you want, and click Save. Then again, once you've made it, you can click on it, copy this number, and paste it in here. And as you can see, all of these levels will be generated like this. They'll look the same, and they'll have also purchasable things in every level. And that's the end of the video now. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this.